Hey there guys, my name is Marcus and in this video I'm going to compare Monday.com and Todoist. The first thing I'm going to talk about are the main advantages and disadvantages of both of these tools. Then I'll talk about like what I like and don't like about main features and what do I actually recommend and also pricing. Both of the tools are really great to use but they are completely different. Because Todoist is mainly, in my eyes, productivity tool which you can use for, let's say, yourself and also as a project management for like two, three people maximum. And that's for what I would use actually to do is I wouldn't use to do is as a project management for like team of five people and more. I would definitely go for Monday.com and let me show you. So to do is in to do is you will see that, okay, you have your own, uh, like your own personal productivity tool, which you got like in your own tasks. And then you get your own projects that you can like create here and also invite people. When you would open a task, you can simply add a subtask, comments, activity. And this is pretty much it. So to do is really simple. It's all about simplicity, right? But on the other hand, Monday.com, you can main table, timeline, map, then you can like add views here as a Gantt, workload, forms, charts, even more views that you can create here if you would go here to the right side, you would even see that you can add, let me show you. You get to see status people, you can do the time tracking. Also, you can do progress tracking. So it's like really complex. And in this way, you get to see like the main table here, for example, I can simply click a new property as a new task. When I'm going to open it, I can see updates and everything. And when I'm going to like add, look at this status, or time tracking, I can simply start time tracking the task that I want. And yeah, when we look on the pricing and what I like, Monday.com offers you only 14 day trial. They don't have free, they don't have free account. So you can actually like test it out, create account on both. What do you actually prefer? Because Todoist offers you like free account up to 50, after eight, like 80 projects, up to five people per project. And again, Todoist is a perfect tool for using it uh, for two, three people maximum. That's for, I would use it like for family, for yourself and someone in your team. But Monday.com is much more complex. I would definitely use Monday.com if I want to be with more people, even a three, five, 10 people, go with the Monday.com, it's, it's a much, much better tool. So yeah, thank you very much everybody for watching. If you have any questions, guys, ask me down in comments. I'm really happy to help you and provide you some guidance and stuff like that in here. See ya.